this is Connie and welcome back to my paranormal romance obsession and today we are still talking about Sookie Stackhouse series by Charlene Harris or better known as HBO's True Blood and we are moving on today to books five and six and let's just get started on those number five is Dead as a Doornail isn't that adorable? I just absolutely love these covers. So the cover art is staying true to form there with the same style. And let's read about number five in the Sookie Stackhouse series. Small town cocktail waitress Sookie Stackhouse has had more than her share of experience with the supernatural. But now it's really hitting close to home. When Sookie sees her brother Jason's eyes start to change, she knows she's about he's about to turn into a were-panther for the first time. A transformation he embraces more readily than most shapeshifters she knows. But her concern becomes cold fear when a sniper sets his deadly sights on the local changeling popula population, and Jason's new panther brethren suspect he may be the shooter. Now Sookie has until the next full moon to find out who's behind the attacks and Lex the killer decides to find her first. That is a doornail. I love this series. It is fun. It's whimsical. It's fantastical. It's um, got all kinds of supernatural beings in it, which I love the mix. I, I like... I like when a book has vampires and werewolves and different shapeshifters in it, not just one, not just focusing on one supernatural being. I love that. All right, the next one is number six in the Sookie Stackhouse series, and this is definitely dead. Aren't they cute? I just think they're so cute. And there's something in the covers that has to do with that certain book every time. So make sure you look at the tiger. All right, so number six is, Since Louisiana cocktail waitress Sookie Stackhouse has so few living relatives, she hates to lose one. Even her cousin Hadley, undead consort of the Vampire Queen of Louisiana. Hadley's left everything she has to Sookie, but claiming that inheritance has a high risk factor. Some people don't want her looking too deeply into Hadley's past or Hadley's possessions, and they're prepared to do anything in their power to stop her. Whoever it is, they're definitely dangerous, and Sookie's life is definitely on the line. So that is number six, and number five in the Sookie Stackhouse series. And thank you so much for joining me today. If you like this kind of stuff, please give me a thumbs up and please share this video. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.